With prom just a month or two away, students are getting everything they need for a very special occasion. However, any parent will tell you, and any student will tell you on their own, that prom is not cheap. WECT's Lauren Schuster joining us now. Lauren, you met with a church group that is trying to ease that prom burden on families, that's for sure, huh? Yeah, that's right, Bill. Wilmington's Grace United Methodist Church is hosting a free prom shopping event called Cinderella's Closet, and that's taking place today and tomorrow. Over 1,000 dresses in all sizes, shoes, accessories, and minor alterations are being provided at the event. It's a volunteer-ran event with everyone from greeters to seamstresses, and the dresses are donated from people in the community, along with prom dress stores that want to get rid of their out-of-season dresses, which means some dresses in Cinderella's Closet are brand new with tags. All are welcome from surrounding counties, and it's not just students from New Hanover County. And with it being the first year back since the start of COVID, the volunteers are excited to find the dream dress for a girl attending their prom this year. I really love it. I really love being able to help girls come here and just uh, feel beautiful for the day. I mean, it's not just about feeling beautiful on the outside, but also just being able to sort of share the love of our community with them. And now no walk-ins are available, it's by reservation only. And as of yesterday, there were about 40 girls signed up and there's still time slots available for tomorrow's event. And I'll have the link to the sign up on the story on our website. And Bill, most prom dresses are only worn once in a lifetime. Mm -hmm. So it's great that people in the community are giving their dresses a second life for teenagers this year. Yeah, that could be good news for uh, lots of young people. I know just a couple of weeks ago, I was really surprised that prom started so early for a couple of schools because I had dinner downtown on a Friday night and it was packed with people. I was like, what's the occasion? Yeah, I never knew. Usually it's right before graduation, yeah, no. so I'm surprised to hear that They too. said it was prom and it was early, so the place was packed. Okay, it's better but than not having it at all, like most students did a few years go, ago. There you go, huh? Yeah, yeah, with the pandemic, that's for sure. Again, you know, we talk about that. It's not that long ago for you as well, but you still got that dress somewhere? I do. It's in my closet, gaining dust, so um, I should think about, you know, donating it to other students. Yeah, there you go. All right, Lauren, thank you very much.